Hey everyone, this is Craig with GottaBeMobile.com and I'm going to quickly show you how to authorize a computer on iTunes on Windows. Currently I'm running Windows 7, uh, but this still applies to Windows 8 and Windows 10. So, essentially, iTunes authorization uh, has to do with uh, DRM, digital rights management. And that essentially just means that when you download or when you buy a movie or a TV show on iTunes, you can't just freely share that with anyone. You know, you can't just copy it to a flash drive and just give it to someone. Uh, so, uh, authorization means that uh, Apple gives you up to five computers to share that media on as long as those computers uh, are logged in to uh, your Apple ID account. So in order to authorize a computer on Windows you'll open up iTunes obviously I already have it open you'll go all the way up to the left hand corner where there's this little tiny icon and you'll click on it and it'll bring up uh, a menu and then you'll select iTunes store you'll go over and then you'll click authorize this computer and then you will simply enter your Apple ID and password so I'm going to do that now hit authorize And it'll give it'll give me a pop-up that says computer authorization was successful. And it'll tell me how many computers that I currently have authorized. As you can see, I have three computers out of the five, the maximum five that I have available. Click OK. And I'm good to go. That's I mean that's as easy as it is. From here I can buy a movie using my Apple ID account, or I can access my current library. Uh, on this computer 